Welcome to RK Tutorials, Solutions to Engineering Mechanics by S. Timoshenko, 5th edition. In this tutorial, we will discuss problem set 3.2 and problem number 3.13. The four wheels of a locomotive produce vertical forces in the horizontal grider AB as indicated in figure D. Determine the reactions RA and RB at the supports if the loads P is equal to 90 kN and Q is equal to 72 kN. So this is the grider AB supported with uh, hinged support and roller support. Our interest is to find the reactions at A and B because of these loads P and Q. P and Q values are given. Now let RA be the reaction at A and RB is the reaction at B. In fact at A you can also find a horizontal reaction because it is a hinged support. Since there is no any other horizontal force acting on the grider AB, I can consider RH is equal to 0 and I need not to consider. I am considering only the vertical force RA and there is only one force at B that is reaction force RB. By applying the equilibrium equation, I can say sigma Fy is equal to 0. Two forces acting in the upward direction RA plus RB and there are four forces acting in the downward direction. 3Ps and 1Q. Hence, RA plus RB is equal to 3P plus Q. And P value is given 90 kilonewtons. Q value is given as 72 kilonewtons. So, I can substitute there and I will get RA plus RB is equal to 342 equation number 1. Let us consider the moments about any point on the grider AB. Let us take the moments about point A. So, if I take the moments about point A, P will introduce a moment in this direction. This P will also introduce in this direction. This P will introduce in this direction. Q will also introduce in this direction. But RB will produce a moment opposite to all these things. And you know all the distances. This distance is 1.8 and this is another 1.8. This is another 1.8. This is another 3 meters and this is another 1.2 meters. Since uh, if you know all the distances, so I can comfortably apply the moment equation at point A. So sigma m about A equals to 0. That implies P into 1.8 plus another P into 3.6 plus this P into 5.4 plus Q into 8.4. All these four forces will introduce moment in the clockwise direction. But this RB will introduce the moment in the counterclockwise direction. Hence, that is equal to RB into the total distance 9.6. Here P and Q values are given. So, I can substitute the P and Q values. Then I will get RB into 9.6 is equal to 90 into 10.8 plus Q value 72 into 8.4. And upon the simplification, I will get RB is equal to 164.25 newtons. And this I can substitute in equation 1 where RA plus RB is equal to 342. From that, I can find the value of RA which is 177.75 newtons. So, this RA and RB are the answers for the given problem.